How you holding up? I heard you got an earful from Rebecca last night. Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. Her bark's worse than her bite. What's her problem? Yeah, she's got a lot on her mind lately. Bringing a baby into a world like this. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. Anyone teach you how to shoot? By that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. Yeah, but not a rifle. Well, that makes sense. Less kick. This thing would probably knock you on your ass. Nick was about your age, first time I took him hunting. Came across this beautiful 13-point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle, he lines up the shot just like I taught him, and then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. What a baby. Hey! Why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. Anyway, so I grab the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang, the gun fires. Boy nearly gut shot me. And of course, the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Cause you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I apologized already. She accepted. Okay, well I didn't know that. It's fine. He apologized. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Leaving us again. I know where the fucking river is. So anyway, I found that buck later that season. Shot it right in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play a role. Even if it means people you love hate you for it. You should tell him that. Uncle Pete! Nick! Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Ah, full of holes. Who do you think did this? Not sure yet, but it ain't your average gang of thugs, that much I know. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? Check those guys there. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. What can I do? See if you can find anything else. Like what? Like what might tell us who did this. This one's shot too. Through the head? Yeah. Check the rest. And look for ammo. We're running low. Can I help? I got it. There. This wasn't no rinky dink pissing match. What was it then? Fubar. Where are you going? We need to get the fuck out of here. Gotta check the rest. What? Why? Calm down and think about it, son. Calm down? We gotta get out of here now. Jesus Christ, get a hold of yourself. Nick's right. This doesn't look good. No, it don't. One of these folks might still be alive, and they might just be inclined to tell us who did this. We gotta do this now. Stay here. Keep searching these. This is a dumb idea. You know, Nick, I don't like this either. 
But sooner or later, you're gonna have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're an asshole? That nobody in this world is ever gonna give a goddamn whether you like something or not. You gotta grow up, son. Whatever. Come on, Clem. You wanna be useful? Keep a lookout on that tree line. Whoever did this might still be out there, waiting for another sucker to stumble across this mess, just like baiting a fish. I'd be more useful with a gun. I don't doubt it. At some point, you guys have to trust me. Hell, I trust you. But not everyone's at that point yet. Give them time. Look, just keep your head on straight. Same deal. All shot to pieces. Hope this isn't anyone you know. No. Good. Damn it. More on that side. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were. What happened to you? <coughs> you were in the woods with Krista. The woman I was with. What happened to her? Please, tell me. Tell me! <coughs> Please. Fine. Just just lost my footing. Damn it. God oh. damn it. Oh god. Lurkers! I'm out of ammo! Come this way! Bitch! Damn it! You get your asses over here, both of I'll you! I'll cover you! We gotta get out of here! Get over here, god damn it! Can't you listen to me once? Come on! Come on! Shit. Oh shit, that's it. What are you gonna do? Someone's outside. Nick? Someone came here looking for you. A man. What? Did he say what his name was? We know damn well who it was. Who is he? One of the guys we were with before. What's he gonna do? I can't keep going. I figure we got about four, five more days to reach those mountains. We ain't here to rob nobody. Just relax and put the gun down, man. dead Krista oh god what happens next oh man this game oh I love this part 
Uh, did you try to save Krista? You and 58% of players stopped to help Krista. Did you kill the dog? You and 52.5% of players killed the dog. Did you accept Nick's apology? You and 50.6% of players accepted Nick's apology. Did you give water to the dying man? You and 57% of players refused. Yeah, fuck that guy. Uh, heroics. Did you save Nick or Pete? You and 60.6% of players went with Pete. Yeah, that makes more sense. He's literally, he's had our back, you know, thus far. And Nick, it, Nick had a gun full of ammo. Like, he was fine. <laughs> Well, that concludes episode one. That was actually a lot of fun. I enjoyed that. Um, yeah, no, the first, the whole intro is just insane. Life is for the Where Omi dies. And then just time skip to 16 months and then instantly get attacked. Like, oh, just really awesome and exciting. You feel that you should uh, I'm not sure about this new group. Like, I like Luke and Pete, but looks like Pete might die. Which is sad. Um, Nick, eh, like Carlos guy, whatever. And the daughter is just very, like, oh, she's gonna die horribly. Goddamn. Oh, but overall fun. Obviously, just keep going with it. Just see where the next episodes take us. I wonder who uh, who we run into. Who she thought was dead. It's God. I so it could be Krista. I think that's the obvious thought. But I I always have this theory that Kenny wasn't actually dead. Because if you think about it, at the end of the game, when it shows everybody and all the decisions you make with them. And it says for Kenny that he's lost to the herd, where everybody else, when they die, it says that they were killed or they died. But for Kenny, it doesn't say that he died to the herd. It says he was lost to the herd. So I'm not sure if that was, like, deliberate writing to be like, oh, no, we're going to bring him back, or if he is actually just dead and it's probably just Krista. Guess we will see, though. Our heads above the tea. Your heart's above the line Above the line And who we are today Can never make amends For what we've done Tainted blood And his eyes His eyes are full of love Forgive them, release them. Above the line, above the line.